So as I was saying earlier, Pardot is the sales, is sales first marketing automation platform and Pardot will help you automate internal and external processes. So some examples of internal processes that you can automate with this platform are things like assigning prospects. So for example, when you're running a campaign on Google Ads, Facebook Ads, or when you're sending an email, and then you're getting new prospects that are filling out your, your forms either on the website or on a landing page, you can automate the process of assigning each of those prospects or leads to the sales reps in your company. And there are a bunch of ways uh, and you can do this. You can do a round robin assignment so that every single person on your sales team gets, the, gets an equal amount of leads. Or you can also assign more leads to those uh, sales reps that are having better metrics or better sales. So that's one of the, of the simplest processes that you can automate with Pardot. Then another thing that I also like is that you can also grade and qualify your prospects. Uh, and these are really helpful tools just because uh, when you're getting a lot of prospects, it, it can be sometimes difficult to manage them and to understand which ones have a higher priority or which ones are uh, closer to becoming your clients. So grading and qualifying prospects also allow you to understand and, and define that priority for your sales team so that they don't necessarily waste their time uh, reaching out to prospects that are not qualified or that are not a good, a good fit for your company. Then with Pardot, with Pardot, you can also uh, manage and centralize all your marketing efforts in one single platform. And I think this is one of the greatest benefits that Pardot has. So uh, in, in with, with some of my clients, I've seen that they're using one platform for email marketing, another platform for uh, landing pages, another platform to manage their, their social networks and automate their, their organic posts and so on. And one of the main issues that I've seen with these clients is that before they, they they actually moved to Pardot, they actually had to create all these reports individually by gathering all the data manually. And the biggest issue is that it can be really hard to sort of like integrate these different platforms to have a standardized data. Uh, so I do think that the fact that you can manage all these different things on Pardot is definitely a plus for the platform. So on Pardot, for example, you can uh, you have a module to create uh, emails and send uh, email marketing campaigns. And it's really easy to use. You can either use the drag and drop feature to create emails. So even if you don't have knowledge of HTML or CSS, you can always just choose the drag and drop option and create really good looking emails. But then if you do have a, a, a designer uh, on your team, you can also implement emails through HTML and CSS. And that can be really helpful if uh, having a really good design is a priority for, for your company. Then uh, you can also create landing pages on Pardot. So similar to email marketing, you're also able to uh, create landing pages inside the platform. And one of the benefits is that on Pardot, you can also uh, use the drag and drop feature to create landing pages, or you can also implement landing pages via HTML and CSS. Uh, then you also have the, the, the possibility to use Pardot forms on your landing pages on your web or on your website. And this will actually allow you to uh, see whether or not uh, you're able to, to capture information directly to Pardot. Then uh, Pardot also offers a, a functionality for, uh, for keywords. So when it comes to SEO, you can also uh, track what is the performance that your keywords are having. And then based on that performance, you can see what is the ranking for your specific keywords or in which, we, on, or in which keywords you need to actually improve. Uh, your, your organic positioning. Then on Pardot, you also have a module for to track your competitors in terms of SEO and see how your competitors are uh, ranking with specific keywords. And then once you have that analysis from your competitors, you can also get a better idea on what are the things where you need to improve. And then another module that Pardot also has is a module to manage social networks. Uh, so basically when, when, it, when you're doing organic post on Pardot, uh, you can always uh, automate everything. You can always automate everything inside the, the platform. And you can also automate your organic social network posts uh, on Pardot. And the main benefit of integrating your Pardot uh, social, your social networks to Pardot is that then you will also be able to have uh, a lot of uh, good information and, and tracking of what, in terms of what is the effectiveness of your organic efforts uh, in terms of results such as opportunities or even revenue. So then some other uh, benefits that Pardot has, and, and one of the things that I 
really like about Pardot is that it allows you to personalize content and communication to your prospects. Uh, and here, in order to be able to do this, you have a bunch of different modules inside Pardot. So the first one is the Engagement Studio. And the Engagement Studio allows you to do uh, drip campaigns or automated email programs. And uh, in the Engagement Studio, you can create very simple automated uh, emails, such as when people fill out your contact your contact us form, then they will automatically get an, a follow-up email, just saying something like, thank you for giving us your information. We'll be in contact with you soon. So that's one of the simplest versions of uh, marketing e email marketing automation that you can do. But then uh, with the Engagement Studio, you can create a lot more complex email programs. Uh, so basically the way the Engagement Studio works is that you have sort of like a decision tree and you can define what are the actions that will happen in, in each of the branches. So for example, if you send an email, then you can divide a branch to see uh, which pe people opened the email and which, which people didn't. So to those people who did open the email, then you can follow up with a different uh, type of email. For those people who didn't open the email, you can send them uh, any other type of content. Uh, and then another, that, that's an, also an, uh, a simple uh, example of, of a drip campaign that you can create. But then on Pardot, you can also do stuff like automate the follow-up process for all of your clients. So I, I have one client actually, whose uh, sales cycle lasts between uh, six months to one year. Uh, and basically people are, are taking an average of nine months to actually make a decision to actually hire them or not. So during, we, we actually created a, a, a drip campaign in, 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 the engagement, in the engagement studio that we'll be sending emails for people throughout nine months. And we'll be sending one email every 10 days just uh, to provide useful information to our prospects, just to tell them more about our products and so on. But the main objective of, of doing this is that we want to stay on, 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 on people's minds just so that when, when it comes a time for them to make a decision, they will be thinking about us first. Then you can also do audience segmentation on Pardot, on Pardot. And basically audience segmentation allows you to create uh, segments of your database. So basically you will be having all of your database inside Pardot, but you can start creating these clusters or segments based on specific types of information. So for example, I have some clients that uh, have created audiences based on people that have received a quote, but haven't uh, made a purchase yet or haven't become our clients. Then we also have uh, another segmentation for people that have either attended webinars or downloaded uh, eBooks or, or white papers that we have. And then depending on the audience that, we, that we've been able to segment, we'll be sending them uh, a specific content to their uh, purchasing stage in, in which they are. And then another feature that, that I also like a lot is dynamic content. So dynamic content on Pardot allows you to, uh, as the name says it, have uh, content that is specific to each prospect. So the simplest example of, of dynamic content is that if you send an email, then those people who are in the United States will see the email in English. And then those people who are in Ecuador, for example, they will see the, the email in Spanish. So that's one simple example of dynamic content. But you can also uh, have dynamic content that is specific to each of the life cycle stages of your, of your prospects. So you can make sure that if, 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 if one of your prospects visit the website, which means that they already are on your database, then instead of seeing a form, they will end up seeing a video. And then if a brand new uh, user visits the website, they instead of seeing the video, they will see the form. So dynamic content is, is a really good uh, tool to make sure that users are seeing only the right information for them. And then again, the main benefit of actually having Pardot and being able to centralize all these different tools into, in, into one single platform is that later you will be able to have uh, a better, better dashboards, better reports, and basically measuring the impact of your marketing efforts will be a lot easier. Uh, so just as an example here, I had one client that before they implemented Pardot, they were spending an average of four hours per week coming up with reports that they would have to present to their uh, management team. After they implemented Pardot, now they are actually spending those four hours interpreting the data. And once they, they are able to analyze the data, they can make better financial decisions or product decisions, or just understand what are the marketing efforts that are uh, working better or driving more results for, for their company.